Hey there guys, um, today another video, um, today I want to create a video about the video game uh, SWAT 4, it's a SWAT uh, simulation game for the PC and I always loved this series but um, recently I came by by checking the files of the game itself that you can actually um, hack the ENI files to get custom resolutions. So uh, normally the max resolution for the game is 1600 by 1200 and with the custom uh, thingy you can do yeah, like every resolution you want. So how do we do this? Um, so you go into your um, SWAT4 folder and you, you can change this um, for both the expansion and just the game. So if it's the expansion, uh, do the same steps in the content expansion folder. And if it's just SWAT4, then yeah, just do it in the SWAT4 um, folder. But I'm going to show you how to um, change it in both of the games. Well, it's actually one game, but both the normal game and the expansion. So, uh, the first thing you need to go is to C, Program Files, Shara, SWAT4, and then um, Content or Content Expansion, uh, depends on what you want to change. And then, well, let's just say uh, SWAT4, and then uh, System, and there should be a uh, file called swat4.ini in here. If you don't have it, start up the game once, uh, change the resolution in game, and the swat4.ini will be created. Um, so if you open this with uh, Notepad plus plus or just a simple Notepad, and you press Control F, then you need to search for the word called full screen. and then uh, search and then close this and then you will see uh, full, full screen viewport X uh, and uh, full screen viewport Y um, so normally if you uh, change it to the last um, resolution there should be uh, viewport X uh, 1600 viewport Y um, 1200 and um, yeah so if you want to have the custom resolutions um, just change it to whatever you want for me that's uh, 1920 uh, by uh, 1080 and um, yeah when you've changed that just save the file uh, and close it but you're still not done um, go to the properties of the SWAT INI and um, yeah, make sure it's on read only. Uh, this will prevent the game from rewriting um, the INI file to the 1600 by 1200 uh, resolution because uh, normally the game doesn't allow you to have greater resolutions. But as long as this is on read only, then that should be no problem. So that's how you change the resolution in the normal game. Now for the expansion. So you go to your SWAT folder again, your SWAT4 folder, and then go to content expansion, then again system, and then instead of SWAT4.ini you have to find SWAT4x.ini. So let me just find it here real fast. Uh, look, there it is. Swat 4 I and I. Same step here. Press Control F and search for full screen. As you can see, there are also the full screen viewport X and full screen viewport Y. And that's also the same for me, uh, 1920 uh, by. Uh, 
so then save it again and also make it read only so um, you prevent the game from um, reforcing it into um, yeah not your resolution so w when you've done that both um, I'm just going to show you one thing um, when you run uh, the expansion pack or the normal game uh, you will get an error uh, like this one filter right uh, C profile zero SWAT for content expansion system SWAT exit I and I this actually means that he wants to rewrite the file and um, yeah but because we made it read only uh, he cannot save the file so just ignore this and press OK and you're good to go with the full resolution so uh, I hope you like this um, tutorial and uh, till the next video later